Now it's time to work with views in Revit. So the first thing we will do it's a section. In Revit there are two different type of sections. It's two-dimensional sections for documentation uh, and three-dimensional uh, section in a three-dimensional view. We will start from two-dimensional section and you can uh, create this type of section in a plan or elevation or section view. So I go to my level 1 and say view section. Now I need to specify the first and uh, the second point of my section and Revit will create a straight section. Here it is. After uh, first section is created, uh, I'll receive a new group in my project browser. So here it is, section 1, and I can pick my section and check its name, it's section 1. Alright. So section has a view region, like a plan view, and also a section has uh, section heads in the uh, on the both sides of section line. So uh, now I'll go to my section. You can go to your section just by double clicking your uh, section in project browser or just right click and go to view. Uh, when you have a lot of different sections I prefer to uh, just uh, select my section and go to view because if you Oh, uh, if you'll go by project browser you need to know a uh, section name. Sometimes uh, there are a lot of sections uh, near one place and it's just easy to uh, pick it and say go to you. So it's section, it's view in Revit like a plan so you can customize your detail level, your colors, shadows, uh, boundaries and so on. So now I uh, turn off three-dimensional view, say window tile and ZA to zoom all in my windows and uh, you can modify your section boundaries and far clipping. But uh, if you want to, you can turn off your view cropping and turn, turn off your far clipping. So this line it's the end of your uh, visibility space. So if you want to turn it off, you just can go to far clipping and say no clip. Here it is. And by default your section is a straight line. If you want to create some segments, you need to pick your section and say split segment and uh, uh, define where you want to place your segments, for example. Here, here, and here. Uh, as you can see, when I define the place to create a segment. Uh, when I move my mouse on the one side, I'll, uh, I'll start to move one part of my section segment. When I uh, move my mouse to other side, I start to move the other part of my section. Like this. And you can create the new one, for example, section here. And uh, if you're wrong with section direction, you just can say flip section like this and say go to you. Here it is. Uh, 